We're back on dead plate. Let's go. So, I mentioned this last time. We are going to do the ending hunt for this. It turns out there's four endings to dead plate. We got the first one last time, which you get from just like playing the game normally. And I looked up like how to get the other endings. I don't know what the other endings are. I just looked up how to get them. Um, and it turns out we need to get a phone call in order to get the other three endings. So we're gonna work on that. And I'm personally excited. My cat is with here. My cat is here with me. There we go. Um, today, so if you hear meowing, that's her. <laughs> Ugh. I'm excited. I want to know what else is happening here, especially with our boy Vince. Vincent. Vincent Van Gogh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I gotta get used to the controls again. Oh, no. This is fine. You know what? We'll be fine. Okay, nothing bad ever happens to anyone, ever. You know? So, we're actually gonna hit continue and what file do i need okay so that was at the end of day one end of day two end of day three i believe so we need to start on day three for this so i'm gonna go from file two there i am look at me hello roadie I missed you. We're gonna try and not get you killed. But I'm gonna let you know now, Rhodey. Um, in my experience, I'm not good at keeping people alive. So... I wish you luck. <laughs> okay. What do we have bought so far? Let me... let me see. Read the catalog. Do we have anything bought yet? Oh. Oh, wait. I have the matches. So do my items stay with me even if I go back a day? Oh, I like that. I was right, we are gonna need the matches at some point. I just didn't know how to use them. Get out of here, mouse. Okay. We're gonna check the window again, because I have a system. Okay. And we already have a save here, so I'm just gonna lie on the couch and I'm gonna end the day. Okay, sweet, day three. So we don't need the matches until day seven. So we're gonna equip the cologne. Just cause, uh, knowing my skill, I'm gonna need it. And we're gonna start our shift. So all we have to do on day three is just take out the trash. Which I can do. Hello. This way, I'm gonna seat you here. And what can I get you? So you guys would like appetizers. And can I take out the trash just like right now? Ooh! Ooh! Ow! Ooh! 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 Ew! You! 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 What's in that? Oh, I don't like that at all. Okay. Um, interesting. Very, very interesting. Ah, did- I'm sorry. There's something in the trash. I think I might have ripped the bag open when I dropped it. Okay. Uh-oh. I think it cut me. I swear I didn't throw anything away. I wasn't supposed to. I don't think. Vince? You good? 
I can clean up the mess. I'll just need a second. <gasps> no! 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 You don't need to worry about that. Someone else will get the mess. Let me see your hand. Was that a... Was that a smack of, like, anger? Or... To halt his anxiety, or both? I can't tell if Vince is a good guy. I really can't. You can't be serving customers with this. Try to be more careful next time. Right. Um... Okay. Jesus, spooky land. Okay, grab this guy. He's table for one. Let's see him here. Let's take this. Okay. Oof. We're gonna go down here. And then we're gonna be like, yo, what do you want? And he also wants it. I think they follow like the standard line here appetizers main side and then dessert so at least they all follow the same thing which is good okay and i've got i've got a better system now that i've been doing this for a while yep you guys would like a main get one of those started. We're gonna pick up this. We're gonna bring it down here. We're gonna go up here. We're gonna pick up this. We're gonna do that. And you know what? We're gonna serve this guy as well. We're gonna do that. And we're gonna do that. And we're gonna serve those guys. Go here and finish up them. And then he'd like a side. And this is their last plate. Cool. And you guys are sides next. better at this. Okay. Okay. We may have bandaged up the cut, but like, um, the freaking bruise on our face from getting smacked by Vincent. Can I? Yeah. Cool. And then you guys are now on desserts. Oh, we're good. We're good. We got this. We've done it. We've done it. We got through the day with a smack to the face and a cut on our hand, but we got through it. Can I clean this up? Yes. Perfect day. Beautiful.
Yeah, does our fridge have the other dishes? Yeah, so our fridge still has the other dishes. Okay. So next on day four, we have to talk to Vince and this time ask about um, whether or not he likes his job and about the raise. The raise was the option I didn't do last time. Just because I, I didn't want to be insensitive and, well, invoke his wrath. I like looking through the catalog. Schooling and or ten years experience required. Located at the same place. Dishwasher. Walk-ins available. Located at this place. Okay. Whew. Okay. So, look out the window. No one there. Lie on the couch, and we're gonna save... Today was the end of day three. So we're gonna override all our file three save. Because I want to ensure I have that. Okay. And then we're gonna end the day. Now day four, we walk into the kitchen past a minute mark. And I'm not sure how long a minute is in this game. I think we just have to trigger the cutscene with um, Vince burning the cook's face off. I wonder why Rhodey starts, like, having nightmares. Because these are, like, very specific to Vince's probably cannibalism, which Rhodey doesn't know about, does he? So, I'm very intrigued. Alright. We're ready. We're gonna wait by the door like a gentleman. Okay, table for two. And what would you like? You'd like an appetizer, you'd like an appetizer. And then, okay. Table for four. You guys are main. And you are appetizer. Okay. I'm not sure how long, like, a minute is in this game. I'll just periodically check in the kitchen until the scene activates. There we go! And we're gonna skip by this, this time. <laughs> Vince has got some anger issues. I, I think he's gonna need a 30 day chip to start working here again. Okay. I'm not gonna go back and see him eventually because I do have to temper the customer's attitude as well. And now we'll go back and see him. And we'll talk to Vince. Hello, Vince. First off, are you single? I'm gonna ask that every time. I want it to be on record that I have asked him. Okay, I mean, we know Rhodey's currently on the outs with his girlfriend. Why, we're not sure. So, do you like your job? He seems to like his job. 
And now, can you give me a raise, please, Vince? <laughs> so, is that a no, or? Oh, right, yeah, that's a no. You're not getting a raise. Uh, what do you need one, anyways? Well, it's for a girl. Her name is Manon. You should have just enough by the end of the week, but just a bit more could be ample for something really special. You make tips, you're good at your job, and you'll do good enough for whatever pet project you have outside of it. Boo. What do you need this much money anyways? Is she really that excessive with cash? Of course not. Well, I mean, a little, yeah. She's not prissy or anything. And she's worth it. Every cent of it, she's worth all of it. And while I can show her just how much she means to me, this will all be worth it too. Hmm. What? Nothing. Alright, Tumblr, I've done your service. Okay. Okay, hopefully that didn't F up my customers here. Okay. And I think I have the cologne earlier. Ew. You got the side. I'm gonna put the other side back on. We're gonna hand that over to him. Then these guys should be done. We're gonna get started. She'd like a dessert. He'd like a dessert. Okay. Oh, wait. Dessert is up here. more stressful than it looks. At least these guys are done. And I mean for you. Okay. I will take your money. Clean that up. And now we're on sides. Cool. Oh. Man, this game is... This game is simultaneously so calm with like its smooth jazz and its really cute art style. But it's also so stressful and so accurate. All right. Luckily, these guys are the only ones left I have today. Eight like is it? I'm also gonna go up here and... Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to shoot away, but you know what? Now we get to see if that changes anything. Cause I accidentally gave some cheese. <laughs> Those who work in the service industry, is this accurate? I've only worked a little, I don't know. <laughs> oh, sweet, and then those guys are done.
It won't let me take out the trash. Which means I can clean up their table. And accept the money. Beautiful. Oh my god, so that's what happens if I feed the rat instead of shooing it away. Oh, now I'm glad I did that. I got to see that. Okay, now we're moving on to day five where we have to ask Vince about his favorite food. Vince is surprisingly amiable with us. Oh, wow. Because this is the one I got before, the strawberry shortcake. No wonder this shelf was completely empty. Wow. So I guess, like, we're gonna get these off of the other three endings? Interesting. This is so creepy. So creepy and cute, I love it. Should we call Man on again? Let's call Man on. Let's be the clingy boyfriend we are. Also, dude, when a girl tells you she needs space, you're probably not gonna see her again. Granted, I think she might also be dead, maybe because of Vince, but I'm not gonna tell you that. I'm gonna tell you guys that. All right, let us save. And this was the end of day four. And uh, end the day. Is that right? Proceed to try and move. Whoa, oh my God. Sorry, I was looking at him. The ending guys drop my phone. All right, let's start my shift. Can we go talk to Vince right away? Hey, Vince. I wrote, Jesus, you look terrible. Oh, poor dude. Okay. First off, what are you reading? I'm gonna try like all the dialogue options. So we find out his favorite food is lemon, most probably because of the sensation rather than the taste. And we get some bonding moments. Is this the same as last time? Yeah. And you know what? Let's ask the can I have a break one. I'm getting kind of tired. I can't tell whether or not he's a good guy. Why? Did you not have anything for lunch? It's more so because of the... Never mind, um, I can afford to bring anything. Hmm. I suppose I could let you eat the leftovers of patrons that didn't finish their meal after all. Really? You're being serious? Sure I am. And you better enjoy those meals more than those <laughs> I'm assume he says the F word. Customers didn't appreciate the table scraps I'm bothering to feed you. Once your shift's over, all these dishes better be licked. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking spotless, or all of these meals are coming out of your paycheck, alright? Hey, hey, sir. Okay, I'm kind of in love with that. Alright. Let's go sit, this girl. You'd like an appetizer. You'd like an appetizer. Whew. Oh, hello. Hi, Driz. Welcome to the chat. I'm getting threateningly cared for by my boss, who may or may not be a cannibal. But that's just life, you know? 
and if I'm gonna end up losing customers right now because I cannot figure out how to move again. Table for two. It's fine, so I'm not like too worried about buying things anymore because I already have the matches. Okay, it was all worth it to trigger the phone call from Vince. Okay. You want a main. You want a main. You have an appetizer. music getting like just as high as I am like high stress I mean not the drugs don't do drugs like it's, it's been it's been a long day it's been a long day one side and you guys want mains. Hold on, I gotta go toss this. Uh, I might have to redo the day at this rate. Okay, that just for some reason won't let me clean it up. Okay. So it seems like the parties of four are a lot more chill than the ones who are less. So fitting them in like size order seems to work. You want a dessert? This is the last of the main. Okay. Boom! The question is, can I reach my quota for the day? Okay. You guys want to side? stress is so real. You have no idea. Ah. Okay. Okay, we're in it. We're in it now. We're in it to win it. We have never been more in it to win it. You feel me? Y'all feel me. Whew. Okay. And then after this, we're gonna serve these guys dessert, and that will be the end of day five and then I think we have to do one more thing in day six with the nighttime bit and then we can trigger the phone call from Vince and do the endings so I think ending three yeah ending three we walk in without no, sorry, ending two, we walk in without the matches. Ending three, we walk in with the matches. And ending four is just if we fail. Um, ending three. So the timer stops at this point. Do I just have to have like all other orders by then? No, man. Okay. Like, 
think of Vince simultaneously has more anger more anger issues than I've ever seen a man with. Yet is simultaneously the most caring guy in this entire thing. Wine. I had to drink water. Okay. Do I reach the quota? I reach the quota. Oh, okay, so this is the ending segment. Okay, um, what do I do here? I have to go into Vince's office, because he's currently in the freezer, and then it's set to check the trash can. A trash can. What is that? That's Vince. Who is the girl? There seems to be crumpled up love letters and endearing notes thrown into the trash can as well. All of them are signed with an M. Was Vince seeing Manon? Was Vince seeing Manon? Forms budgeting out all of the employees' paychecks. His handwriting is awful. Review of the Bistro. I'm just checking out everything. Does all the budgeting himself. Okay. He's currently just in the freezer. This is locked. Anything in the trash? Else I can check out here? A typewriter. Very used ashtray. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here in case he decides to go back to his office and I'll just wait down here for the night to end. Was Vince seeing Manon too? Like. What? I have so many questions. What if Manon is the one he's cutting up right now? I told you I think Vince killed her. I think he did. Okay. Day five complete. Oh, there are flies on it now. Okay. But that should be what triggers the phone call after night six. Yeah, look. Oh my god. Ah, that's disgusting. Oh, don't do my food like this. How is how's my money? I have a good amount of money. Should I just buy stuff? While I'm here. You know? I feel like I should, like, if I keep them throughout my saves, I'm... I'm gonna buy stuff then. Because there's nothing else I use the money for. And then all that's left is the chip, the tip jar, which I don't need. Okay, so after the end of day six, we should get the phone call. Oh, but the fact that Vince was into someone is like so cute yet so haunting because I'm pretty sure she's dead now. Prime example cannibalism. Okay. Oh yeah, and there's the dude at the window. Okay, land couch. Let's save. Today was the end of day five. Okay. And then we just have to make it through day six. Because day six to seven, Vince is... Smoking. In his office, so... Let me double check that that's all I need. Fulfill the shift on day six. And then that is all the prep we're gonna need for the rest of the endings.
if I've done everything right. Hello? Yeah, because Vince is smoking in his office, right? Yeah. Table for two. I got you, madam. Sit here, please. Inform me of your order. Okay, you'd like an appetizer. Let's get that going. for one. Oh my god, move your legs. Okay. Okay. You'd like an appetizer. You'd like a main. Table for two. You'd like a main. You'd like an appetizer. You'd like an appetizer. You'd like a main. You'd like a main. Table for two. like an appetizer, you'd like an appetizer. You'd like a main. You'd like a side. You'd like a side. Okay. You'd like a main. You'd like a side. To like go quiet here because I'm so focused. You'd like me, you'd like dessert, you'd like dessert. This is a dessert, so that's gonna go to you. Okay. That's gonna go to you. to you. Dessert. Dessert. I've never worked so damn fast in my life. Dessert. Dessert. Oh my god, I think the last time I did this one, I did horribly, so. I think 
Heavens. Okay. Heavens. Good heavens. I'm inside the table. Oh god. Boom, baby! Oh, hello already. <laughs> Welcome to the chat. I was indeed speeding. Okay, I, I'm about to get a ticket for this. Ooh, I did it. The focus was so real. The focus was so real. Oh. It's like an adrenaline rush. Now, I went above and beyond for this one, so please tell me I get the phone call from Vince. Yes! Yes, we triggered the phone call! Okay. Pick up the phone. Oh, it's not Manon. Hi, hello? Manon, is that you? Pardon? Oh, Vince. Uh, sorry about that, I thought, uh, n never mind. What's up? Are you free tonight? 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 <laughs> America, yeah. hello! Uh, I'm hosting a dinner party at my apartment and was checking if you'd be available. Oh, that's what you meant. Why, Rody? Rody, what did you think he meant? Rody, answer the question. Wait, you're inviting me? Is that a yes or a no? Uh, yeah, yeah, dude. I wanna go. I, well, sure. But before that, I wanted to ask you about. Be there in the next few minutes. Did we just get asked on a date? Was that a date? Uh, I got the first ending, the first playthrough, because I just did it normally. I guess I can just ask in person. Okay, that was the end of day six, right? So we're gonna save that in file six. This feels like walking into a mouse trap. Maybe I should just ditch and tell him I got into an accident or something the next morning. Oh, good. You made it. Oh, hey! Yep, I am here in the flesh. Wow, super stoked to be here. Wouldn't want to be in any other place on this fine night. <laughs> you don't need to act so excited. Come in. Right. Uh, pardon the intrusion. <gasps> Damn! Damn! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was... <laughs> yeah, I want you to ignore my reaction. I want you to erase that from your memories. <laughs> Please. <laughs> mm. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> this place sure looks, um, well. Your taste and interior design never goes anywhere, I guess. What is with the smooth jazz in the back? Hold on a sec, where? I thought you said this was a dinner party? <laughs> it is. Then why am I the only guest here? Guest? Yeah, I'm supposed to be your guest, right? Oh no, he hired us to work. No, I had to find someone to cater for them when they arrive. Wait, you called me here for work? The dishes are on the kitchen counter. Go push them and ask around if anyone wants one when they get here. Now listen here, I may work for you, but I'm not some kind of pet dog. Besides, I'm actually here to ask you about... about what? Oh, is it about the love letters we found in the trash can? 
It must be them. Were you saying something? Ah, all right, fine. We just got conned into work. The sooner you get to the kitchen, the less painful this gets for everyone. Damn, okay, sir. His house is so nice. There's some awards for culinary excellence tucked in between the books. A bowl of fruit. They look fake. Francisco Goya, St. Francis Borgia helping a dying impenitent? What? Alright, and off I go to the kitchen. A lemon tree. Seems to be the only plant in the apartment still alive. Of course, he would own something like this. Wine. This place is so nice. A sharp cooking knife. A nice oven. It looks well taken care of. Plate of escargots. A cheese platter. Plate of deviled eggs. Okay, let's get some escargot in here. Also, what's in this room? Vince might come check up on me if I take too long with the food. Might be better to get the chores out of the way first before poking around. Wait, what's in his fridge? What's in his fridge? A body? Hello. Hello. What's with that look? Is they're waiting for a plate that catches their eye. Oh, I haven't been reading that. Sorry. So he looks familiar. There's no way. So they need a specific plate. Okay. So you want the escargot. So, who are you supposed to be? What do I answer? What do I answer? I'm gonna answer Vince's best friend, because let's be clear, is there really any option? I'm Vince's best friend. Oh yeah, that was a lie, sorry about that. <laughs> uh huh, you're really bad at this. Well, whoever you are, either Vince must be getting desperate with attendees or has taken a liking to you. He usually doesn't invite anyone that's on your level. My level? What do you mean by- Okay. So we- we are the underlings here. Okay. So escargo was a no-go. <laughs> Does anyone want a cheese platter? How about douchebag on the couch? He wants one. How did you end up meeting Vincent anyway? Uh, through the bistro. Ah, I keep forgetting to read it. Yep. Oh, what was your favorite dish of his? His. I can't pronounce. Funny, I don't recall him ever serving that. It's a new recipe? Hmm. Well, how about you? Where did you meet him? Oh, through university. He went to school? What was he like? Not much different. Quieter. Not as harsh, let's say. What do you mean by harsh? You don't think you're snooping too much, do you? What do you think Vincent would feel about you asking this? I answered through the bistro because that's where he works. Okay. Okay. You successfully get to the Medieval X. What's your favorite thing about the chef's food? Probably, probably how it looks. It looks appetizing? Appetizing? Or, or appealing? Is what I meant to say, like in an artistic way. Oh, that makes much more sense. Yes, I agree, Tyler. Finally, we got one of them on our side. If I'm gonna be honest, this food is, well, it's fine, but it doesn't taste genuine. Like it feels 
incredibly self-absorbed in a way. It's not made for others, you know? Like, what a chef is supposed to do. Does that make sense? Not the slightest. Isn't that what makes him great? Never mind. Your voice is pretty loud, by the way. You know Chef can hear you, right? Wait, he can? Oh, we're finally getting to this guy. Rody? Is that you? Huh? Uh, who said that? I thought I heard a cat meowing. I thought so. It is you. It's me, Richard, from Glass. Oh, uh, all right, one second, guys, I have to let my cat out. <laughs> I've returned. Econ, remember? I think you were majoring in hospitality, too. Ah. Right, right. College is a bit fuzzy for me. I stopped seeing you after a while. Did you switch majors? Well, I, I, he dropped out of college. Oh, Junior, welcome to the stream. I'm gonna be honest, I flunked out. Oh yeah, we kind of assumed. We? Hmm? Everyone in class thought you won't keep up for long. Dang! Poor parents, how did they take it? You must have been really disappointed, right? That is not the questions you should be asking. But it's really surprising to see you again. What I really want to know is how in the world did you end up working for someone like... Chef... Last name... Did you go on your knees and beg him or something? I gotta go. Pardon? I gotta go. Could have just said the bathroom. <laughs> okay, okay, bye. Dang, Evans. Now can we talk? It's gotten you all worked up. Fine, let's hear it. I don't wanna ask this, I don't wanna ask this. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Screw it, screw it, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. How do you know Manon? Who? Uh, Manon, the one whose picture you have in your office? The one who's been sending you letters? My girlfriend? Are you sure we're thinking of the same girl? I saw the picture, of course I'm. Damn! I'm in shock. I'm baffled. I'm baffled. Because that man on said she dumped some pathetic red haired plow a week ago. So it can't be the same one. Well, that. Uh, yeah, but. Stay out of my office, Rhodey. So I was right. It was man on. Oh my god. Also, dude, I totally think she's dead. Bathroom. The cupboards are shut tight, but it's just cleaning supplies inside. A trash can with some grayish brown hair in it. The toilet. Damn. Oh, that's his bedroom. I feel like we shouldn't be in here. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die doing this. I accept my fate. A typewriter and some paperwork. The paperwork seems to be related to running the bistro, but his handwriting is pretty unintelligible. A nice looking bed. It looks like it's the only comfortable piece of furniture in the entire apartment. There's the evidence of someone sleeping on it on both sides. Who the hell are you? Oh! 
Oh, that's so creepy. Oh. Oh, she's gone. Was that man on? Anyway, I wasn't in here. I don't know what you're talking about. Damn. So, do, do I just go now? No, nope, I can't go. So, now, now, now what? Didn't you say you had to? Yep, going. So, what do, what do I do? Ah, Jesus. Can I check in the fridge now? I really want to check in the fridge. Wait, dude, that's... Okay, wait. So, if... Oh my god, wait. I'm sorry, I have so many questions. Um, so Manon ends up with Vincent. But like, is she... Is she dead? Vincent's bedside table. Look inside. You've got freezer key. Whoa. 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 I knew we were gonna die! We're dead. 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 Looking for anything specific? Um, why do I feel like Tumblr's had a field day with this? Um, yeah, I was just looking for the bathroom. And did you think to check the door closest to the kitchen first? What other door? You don't have to serve the other guests anymore. Come on. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, I was terrified. Can I check his fridge now? I really feel like he has something dubious in the fridge. Oh, oh, I'm not moving. That was automatic. Where'd everyone go? The party ended. What? This early in the night? Something came up. Is everything okay? Vince? You better go home. You have work in the morning. Right. My last day. Well, thanks for the party, I guess. Good night, Vince. Good night, Rody. Damn. Damn. Oh. Oh my god. I. What is this game? What is this game? Oh. Uh. Okay. Um. What? Okay, so Rhodey was dating Manon. Dropped out of college. He and Manon broke up. Well, she said they needed space. He didn't take the hint. Because he really loves her. We know from, like, the songs he's been writing about her and stuff. Manon is now dating Vincent. And... Vincent might be a murderer cannibal, maybe? I don't know. He's definitely got some anger issues. And then there was who I assume was a chick outside of his bedroom window staring at us. Who might have been Manon? <laughs> what is happening? Okay, so for day seven, 
To get the ending, we're gonna walk in without the matches first. To get the ending two. Okay. <laughs> yeah, um, don't worry, Junior. The video will be up on YouTube later, so you can watch my initial playthrough. So, ending two, we have to walk in without the matches. Ending three, we have to walk in with the matches and succeed. And then four, we walk in with the matches and fail. Okay. Start shift, I guess. Okay. And it says when the shift starts, go in the freezer. Go inside. Are you sure? Um. Interesting. Huh. I can't, like, interact with anything. Is the door gonna, like, slam shit on me when I go to leave? I know. What? 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 It won't let me leave. What? What? What do? What do I do? I, I can't interact with anything. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh. Oh god. Manon is dead. Oh, that's a picture of us and Manon. Manon? <gasps> no. Did Vincent knock us out? More than that. Shit, 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 shit. Oh god. Oh god. Struggle. The rope's too tough. I can't break it. There's a saw, but I wouldn't be able to reach the handle with my arms like this. Fuck, there's nothing I have on me to cut or burn it. Get away from me. Don't come any closer. Stop. Calm down. You don't have to be doing any of that. You can stop. You're ending up in the same place no matter what you do. Oh my god. Actually, you know what? Maybe if you're fast enough, you'll get out. Hell, I'll even give you a 15 second head start. Really? You'd do that? For me? You mean it? Hmm. Of course. Go on. Go. Oh god. Oh god. Either way, I'm dead. <gasps> I clicked shift. You can't even bother to hurry when your life depends on it. How disappointing. And now we're dead. I think that wait. Oh, so her, like, full name is Marianne? I think I might have accidentally just gotten ending four right now. 
I don't know. I either got ending two or ending four. Yeah, I think I just accidentally got ending four right now. I mean, which is fine. Oh my god. I told you when I first played the game, I told you. Oh wait, no, I did get ending two. Best served cold. You've earned cherry vanilla gelato. But I told you, I told you when I first played the game, he killed Manon. That's why she wasn't answering her phone. I'm telling you. Oh no, it's winter outside. Okay, now we need to do ending three. So we need to go from ending, we need to go from seven, right? Because we have the dream. And now instead, we're gonna equip the matches to burn the rope, and then we have to get away in time. If not, we get ending four. Ending three might take me a few tries. Let's do this. I believe in us, guys. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Go inside. Are you sure? I'm sure. Okay, we're gonna interact with this. Discover Manon's locket. Get taken up by- that's such an intimidating image of Vince. Oh my god. And then... We'll save that as file 9. We wake up. Use the matches. I need to get the hell out of here. It's locked. It's too cold. I don't think I have the strength to break the door open. It won't let me sprint. Can I interact with anything? Seems sharp. Is that? No, it's just beef. I think. I'm not touching that. Mainly just fresh ingredients. There's some bottles of cooking oil near the top. What do I use here? Let's find out. Chat, don't tell me anything. Ruins the fun. It's mainly preserved food. Oh, but the cooler's up above the shelf. There's nothing useful on the shelves, and I can't climb without it falling on top of me. Okay. Bags of flour. Take them. The cooler. It's too cold for me to- maybe there's a way to stop the fan? Okay. Mainly just fresh ingredients. Is that- no? Flip it on. Hmm. The big piles of meat. Ah, cut the meat down to the bone. You got animal bones. Okay. Can I use that to stop the fan? Place bone in the fan. Uh, break open the door window. 
You reach your arm for the handle outside. The door is now unlocked. Go, 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 go. Can I go out through the back? It's locked. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Ow. Hell. 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 Can I go in here? No. A dead plate. Looks like a grilled hanger steak. Oh. Oh! Hey, maybe we can talk about this. Wait, don't come any closer. Oh, dang, I didn't press it in time. Oh, he is a cannibal. Did he just bite my ear off? Did he just bite my ear off? I don't even know what to say to you. How would you ever think of making food out of... It is everything you cook? Do you even hear yourself? No, that's disgusting. I would never serve anything like that in my kitchen. But then... Why her? Then why? Why did you do it? What reason would you have to butcher her like that? Well, I wasn't planning on being the one to eat it. Who the hell was gonna eat it then? What did she ever do to you? Why did you kill her? Because you... <gasps> no! Because you were supposed to enjoy it. What? The dish was meant to be for you. You refused to eat it, and now you've gone ahead and wasted it. It was <laughs> It wasn't for me. That's... Vincent, that's fucking insane. You know that, right? Besides, you never told me your favorite food. Why me? My ear, you ate my ear. Well, don't flatter yourself. It probably would have been better cooked. So you do eat people? No. I can't stand eating. No matter the ingredient, no matter the recipe, everything tastes the exact same. It tastes like nothing. It makes me sick. But with... With you, maybe. Whoa! 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 Ah! How long had you known her? You, you never answered how you know her. There's no point in dodging the question now, right? There's not much else to fucking hide. It wasn't long. This wasn't some long grift. A short while before you asked for the job. You showed passing interest in me, but I wasn't interested. And it felt like an obvious rebound on her behalf. It wasn't until after you gave me your sob story crying over her. More particularly when you showed that much desperation and sacrifice for this girl. And I realized. You realized she was part of the recipe you were looking for. And you weren't even willing to try it. Is he holding, like, a bottle opener? For, like, a wine bottle? Did you care about her? She looked really happy in that photo with you. The photo you trashed in your office. How could you? Did you even care? No. It's just some sick game to you? You didn't even love her? But you did. You cared so deeply about her, and she didn't even mention you. You loved her, probably still love her, with little to no possibility of her loving you back. Don't say that, don't- I was inspired. I've been told I don't cook with love, which is a sentimental and meaningless review in the culinary world. I'm a professional chef, not a parent making a meal for their kid. But I think I understood what they meant when you walked in. Ah! If 
about that one cook? Just, do you do this to all your employees? Is this why you have so few staff members, like the magazine said? What? That one cook, the guy that just disappeared one day? Jesus, yes, because he was fired? Why is he, like, so sensible during this? Why couldn't you have done that to me? Why didn't you quit? Because, because of her. This was all for her. You knew that. You knew that damn well. All right, how could I forget? It's all you ever talk about. No wonder she left you. You're exhausting. Shut up. Your cooking disgusts me. I still can't believe you were planning to feed me something like that. Thank God I never ate any of the food you've been giving me. No! You haven't. It's all just sitting in the fridge, yeah. I don't need to try them to know they don't taste like real food. It always made me lose my appetite. And guess now I know why. You regret it. Why should I? You're the one that asked for the job. You're rotten. Vince, listen, just listen. If everything else so far has tasted nothing to you, what makes you think I'll be any different? If you're really, do if you're really doing all this just so you can taste again, when it turns out I'm just like any other, what will you do? You would have killed her would have killed me for no reason. Are you really ready to deal with that? This is your idea of trying to make yourself happy. I don't think you'll ever be full. Ah! Ah! Let me out! Let me out! Do I just have to push him away enough for, her, for like him to get it? What do I do? <gasps> the wine bottle. You got shattered wine bottle. He hasn't come into his office at all. Was he just legit drinking wine? There's a people looking out over the restaurant. What? So he wasn't just smoking in here, he was watching us. You got restaurant key. His eyes are still following you. Why is there two of me? Why is there two of me? Revenge is best served cold. What? Revenge is best served cold. <gasps> no! Yeah, I, my game has glitched. There's two of me now. You got the cooking oil. No. No.
I should get something to eat. That was amazing! That was amazing! Oh my god, he planned to feed us man on? Hey! I don't think I can keep doing this to you. What? Just this, it's too much. And not enough in all the wrong places. I, I don't understand. We were, I thought we were doing good. What happened? Uh, nothing happened, Rhodey. Just, just give me some time. I've been job hunting for the, after the last place. I'll get enough money. We can go somewhere nice. I promise. Rhodey, is it the apartment? I'm saving up for a nicer place. Really? Brody! Man on! It's not just your apartment or our dates, it's... I can't keep watching you ruin any semblance of progress you're making with yourself while trying to make me happy. It's exhausting. But... You aren't ready for a relationship. You're killing yourself over me and I... I can't have you spending money on someone you don't need. I... You mean well, and I do love you still, I really do. But until you can learn to care about yourself, this will only do harm for the both of us, and I... Oh, that's Manon. I'll see you around, Rhodey. Oh... You earned a whiskey lemon cake. Oh, and she was already dead by the time he got the job. Oh, and now the place is burned down. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is what? Okay. We still have another ending to do. We have to see what happens if I fail the ending scene. So, hold on. Ending, from ending nine, I believe, or file nine. Okay. We wake up in the freezer. We have the matches on us. Okay. Oh, I can't run because it's too cold. Okay, we're gonna interact with that. We're gonna get the bags of flour. We're gonna put the bags of flour down here. We're gonna inspect the cooler. Then we go over here. Oh, and the fact that he wasn't smoking in his office, he was watching us. Alright, can I do this again? Oh my god. And then this one I just have to fail to kill Vincent. Title drop. <laughs> so this one I just fail to touch anything. <laughs> oh well that was that was dead plate guys that was the last ending 
wait, was the white noise I heard at the very beginning of the game? When I first played the game, there was what sounded like white noise. It wasn't white noise, it was a saw. Oh my god, we were listening to Man on getting killed at the very beginning and I didn't even notice. Oh my god. You've earned a coal-fired heart. Oh my god. Oh my god. What was this game? Oh, thanks to my friend who suggested this. I'm... I'm gonna go open AO3 later. <laughs> what did I just play? That was awesome. Unironically though, that was awesome. I greatly enjoyed doing this. And I hope you guys enjoyed this too. If you have any other game suggestions, leave leave comments. <laughs> Wait, best game 10 out of 10 would eat man on? No, Junior! I'm done with chat, I'm done with chat. Okay, if you guys have any other games you want me to play, I don't know. Come come watch another one of my streams and tell me or comment on one of my videos. Um I'm gonna go get something to eat. <laughs> Goodbye.